Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Leo July 27, 2024. You're always open to spontaneous and sexy adventures. Today's cosmic weather will feed this flame within you like gasoline. As the Sun and mighty Mars work in harmony, you'll feel tremendous charisma and magnetic charm surge through your soul. You can rather easily manifest your sensual desires as long as you take the lead and articulate and seduce boldly. If someone doesn't seem interested, turn your affection towards someone who will. This scintillating vibe will make almost everyone hungry for passion, sex, and release. Ooze your confidence and watch as others are turning their heads. There will be so many things to talk about at work. You may feel like there is a buzz in the air when Mercury enters Virgo, its domicile and exaltation. The cosmic messenger will produce more intellectual conversations in your workplace. You and your co-workers may feel more productive, especially when there is a problem to solve. Everyone might be more communicative about what they are doing or working on. Since communication will be a huge focus for your work life, you can use this to your advantage by using your knowledge to impress your cower. Curs. While you are still adjusting to no longer having Mars in your income sector, but with the Moon's return over the weekend set to bring a chance to regroup, Mercury's return to your work sector today is a chance to pick up from where he leaves off. There is still a strong partnership between planets on the income, work and career fronts but from today it is those on the job front that take the driver's seat. With today's planetary energy, it is easy to remind yourself of your health goals. You do have health goals established, right? The notion of balance, objectivity and a healthy lifestyle aptly characterizes you. Add to this the radical energy of today's planetary aspects and you'll feel the winds of change blowing around you. Yes, significant changes can take place now. Keep your mind ready for important decisions with plenty of rest, a healthy diet, and plenty of fresh water. It can be easier to come across as distant or scattered on this day. Chances are, you're anything but this, however, others might think this is the case when you're preoccupied with your work. Many personalities spend time engrossed in thought and planning to the point where they can seem completely out of touch with the rest of the world. By taking the time to let others know that you are just thinking or planning, it can dispel the myth of being aloof. In a case of perfect timing, it is in the heart of the working week and just as the moon is making its monthly visit to a nostalgic and reflective part of your chart that Mercury has reached his last full day in a playful and creative part. As it does with each monthly visit, the moon is putting how well you know when to keep your work hat on and when to take it off, a day before Mercury is due to begin the most active months of the year on the job front. With the sun still in his early days in a playful and creative part of your chart, this is the right reminder at the right time. Even though Mercury reaches his last full day in your romantic sector and when he leaves tomorrow, he will leave the sun and Venus, the planet of love behind, the planet of communication will still be the first planet to return and the last to leave. A retrograde turn will bring Mercury back next month, with his mission to give your heart a voice and to put heart and mind on the same page just getting started. Our Eyes in the Sky As Chiron stations retrograde in Aries, it's an opportune time to delve within and gain a deeper understanding of your trauma and triggers. This retrograde period is a powerful phase to process your pain and uncover its origins. While it might present some challenges, including facing fears or confronting painful truths, embracing this journey can lead to profound healing. By the end of Chiron's retrograde, you could emerge feeling more whole and at peace. At work or in social situations, you'll find that a composed and considerate approach is far more effective than being forceful. The key to success in your interactions lies in your ability to engage with others thoughtfully. This is an excellent time to strengthen your relationships by involving your partner in your activities. Even when things don't go as planned, your calm and relaxed demeanor will leave a positive impression on others and benefit those around you. Today, let's dive into the invigorating and transformative energy that Mercury in Virgo brings. 
As Mercury enters its domicile and exaltation, your attention to detail sharpens, and the mercurial energy becomes exceptional. This is a time to M. Brace new learning opportunities, enhance your communication skills, and connect deeply with those around you. Let's explore how this transit can positively impact your life and bring about meaningful changes. Mercury in Virgo is a period of heightened mental acuity and sharp focus. You might find that learning new things becomes easier, whether it's picking up a new hobby, diving into a research project, or mastering a new skill. This transit is especially beneficial for writing, research, or public speaking projects. Have you ever noticed how certain periods make you feel more mentally agile and ready to tackle challenges? This is one of those times. You may find yourself effortlessly absorbing new information and tackling complex tasks with a newfound clarity and precision. Think back to a time when you felt particularly focused and productive. Maybe it was during a project at work, or perhaps when you were learning something new for fun. Remember how good it felt to be in the zone, fully engaged and making progress. Mercury in Virgo amplifies this feeling, allowing you to make the most of your intellectual capabilities. However, with this sharp focus can come a slight increase. In anxiety. While your mind is clear and your intelligence is astounding, you might feel a bit more anxious than usual. It's all about balance. Use this heightened awareness to your advantage without letting it overwhelm you. Have you ever turned anxiety into a positive force, perhaps by channeling it into productivity or creativity? Sometimes, that extra energy can be harnessed to drive you forward, helping you achieve things you might not have thought possible. For instance, I remember a time when I was working on a big project with a tight deadline. The pressure was intense, and I felt anxious about meeting the expectations. But instead of letting that anxiety paralyze me, I used it as a motivator. I broke down the tasks into manageable steps, stayed organized, and kept pushing forward. The result was not only a successful project but also a boost in confidence knowing I could handle the pressure. During this transit, passionate impulses are also heightened. You'll find yourself reacting more sensitively toward those you care about, which can help resolve any outstanding issues or render them unimportant. If you're single, this could be a time of magnetic attraction, where you am. I'd even flirt with or meet the love of your life. For those in relationships, this energy can reignite the spark and deepen your connection. I recall a time when my partner and I were going through a rough patch. During a similar transit, we both felt a renewed sense of connection and understanding. We started having more meaningful conversations and making an effort to spend quality time together. It felt like the universe was giving us a nudge to reconnect, and it worked wonders for our relationship. 